An idea of creation of electric motor with solar batteries for power supply was for the first time described by Daryl Chapman in 1962. A specific feature of this engine is that solar battery was not only a power source, but also a part of the construction. A glass cylinder on the needle point was used as a low friction bearing part. Thereafter, a magnetic levitation system was used for friction reduction. Engine construction is a four-side square section rotor of an axle and the base that provides magnetic levitation. A rotor consists of two windings with power supply from solar batteries. An axle was horizontal and a permanent ring magnet is on each end. Under there were four additional magnets providing levitation. Under the rotor was a magnet that created magnetic field for making the rotor turn. The mode of operation of such an engine is simple. Light falls on one of the solar batteries. It generates electrical current that passes across the rotor winding. The current produces magnetic field that interacts with the magnetic field under the rotor. The interaction makes the rotor turn 90 degrees. While the rotor is running, another solar battery moves to light and generates current in the other winding. This process is repeated and the engine rotates. The distinctive feature of such engines was that the arrangement did not demand a collector or a communicator. The necessary winding began to work directly with the help of the light.